this is the third lecture on non blocking uh, compared to first lecture so in the first lecture i have used non blocking with uh, intra delay but uh, here you can see non blocking but uh, inter delay so with uh, intra delay as per the first uh, uh, lecture we got output like uh, this a also executing at 5 b also executing at 5 c also executing at 5 okay just uh, i moved this timings to this side in this lecture okay then after execution see the result how it came see now a executing at 5 uh, b at 10 c at 15 so it means what can we understand if i change uh, or if i move this timings to this side now this uh, non blocking code working as a blocking blocking code okay that we have to observe and uh, continue watching uh, still some more to know about this uh, blocking and non blocking in the further lectures i will explain